Hey guys, this is CG Animator, and this is the final part of the Advanced Array Animation tutorial. Now, I'm not going to um, edit the the final efficient preview with this video. I'm just gonna make that uh, post that video after this one and post it as a video response to all of the video tutorials, or to at least this last one. So, um, because uh, if I can't really edit my videos, because if I want to, if I want to keep the quality, I can't post uh, I can't um, I can't render it out because it's already at a very high level so the final pre uh, efficient preview will be a video response to this so anyway but uh, in the last part we tried out um, the motion blur and it wasn't really working so what we're going to use is vector blur and it's really easy to do um, all we need to do here is go to layers and then uh, in the render tab of course and then select vector that's all I need to do there now we select uh, render layers and you want to press shift A and you want to go to filter whoops sorry shift A filter vector blur now you want to take the image with the viewer this there the image to image and the image to image so you want to put it to both of these and now what you want to do is you want to take the render layer and take Z and put it to Z and then you want to take speed and put it to speed and let's you want to put blur to 0.75 and then afterwards, um, let's go ahead and save it off. So if we press F12 now, it will composite everything together. And here's our final efficient. This is what it's going to look like. So, um, actually, looking at it now, we're probably just going to want to put it at 0.7. Let's see how that changes it. And yeah, I'm liking that better. So, file, save. Let's go back to default because that's all we really need. I'm not going to add any depth of field because of the the way we animated it. It would be hard to keep it at that level. So it'll look fine like this. So I'm going to go to frame one here. Save it one more time. And um, yeah, so that's, I'm pretty sure that's it for this tutorial. Okay, so, um, no, I can show some more. So, uh, let me let you guys know. I'm going to put N, I am, because my, uh, my computer can handle a lot. I'm going to put it at 16 anti-aliasing. And now for the output, let's see here. What do we want to do with this? Okay, so you're going to want to render the animation. End is 195. So, uh, let's see, where's AVI? raw here, you want to turn it to AVI raw output I'm going to put it, let's see on my desktop Blender Tutorials and I name this one AAA for advanced uh, array animation except that's what it's going to be called and uh, let's just do a once over just to make sure everything's all right. Hmm. Everything looks good. So when you want to uh, render it, just press render active scene. And that's it. So I want to thank you guys for watching this tutorial and be sh tutorial, sorry. And be sure to watch the video response of the final efficient render. Uh, it's in this video. Okay guys, so Thank you guys for watching, and be sure to watch my future tutorials. Alright guys, thanks.